That's more our speed. Mm Hop -hmm. on a ride at the fair tonight. Opening night of the Yolo County Fair, and yeah, it's a scorcher. His temp soared above 100. Yeah, let's bring in CBS 13's Ashley Sharp there live. All right, Ashley, it looks like that heat, though, didn't keep people away. Hey guys, it certainly didn't. And there's actually more people here tonight now that the weather has cooled off a bit. You heard the announcement over the intercom this afternoon saying, please come back when it's cooler. And people certainly did. Now, just as much of an importance and priority as the fun at the fair is the safety in this heat wave. You're going to be seeing more fans and shade around the fair this year. A huge help on a hot day. Food, rides, and music. It's just a great place. It's like um, a family reunion. That's made the Yolo County Fair a family staple for almost 90 years. I have been coming here for as long as I can remember. It's free entry, it's best selling point. It's the fact that the people come all five days. They come to eat every day. Why wouldn't you? Fair organizers say of all the fan favorites, this year it might be the fans with an opening day high of 100 five degrees a scorcher not stopping the fun well for me i guess it's my rag right here i've been using it i think my eyebrows are falling off this year there's more shade like a new tent at the stage and escape from the sun we're excited about the cooler weather coming our way but in the interim this is really a nice respite for people that want to come listen to the free music it's handheld fans cool treats and bringing in ice water helping families beat the heat we came prepared. I like to get a lot of water. A lot of water. So I don't get super dehydrated. This year, the Yolo County Fair has more rides than ever before. My favorite fair is, is the bumper cars. Expecting 150,000 people through the weekend. Those we spoke to tonight already planning their second trip out to the Midway. What keeps them coming back? The people. The tacos, of course, and the bands. Yeah, so today was opening day and actually the hottest day of this stretch of the fair. It's supposed to start dipping below the 100s on Friday. So that's some good news. Here's two big things for people to look forward to. You've got the Demolition Derby. That's on Friday and Saturday, a huge fan favorite. And then also on Saturday, of course, the reason why we are at the fair, the livestock auction. So all of that coming up this weekend, the fair runs through Sunday. It's like a lot of fun. And you know it's hot when someone's eyebrows might be falling off, that's for sure. <laughs> Yeah. Good time tonight. I can relate to her on that. <laughs> Ashley, thank you.